Hello, this is the Real McCoy Reacts. How's everybody doing out there in the interweb world? Hope everybody had a great Christmas. Everybody's safe. Highly requested song after I've done a couple of St. Mises' stuff. Uh, this is Mises' guest. Uh, Nick Cannon, Lord Jamar, and DJ Vlad Dis. I have listened to the Nick Cannon song they're talking about. I am not going to do a reaction to it. I'm not a big fan of Nick Cannon's, Nick Cannon's regular music and I'm definitely not a big fan of that. Um, I'm just not into the fake news. Everybody, let's uh, divide everybody up. Let's divide the mu music up. Let's divide it, politics up. Let's make everybody divide up. We're all human beings. Man, woman, whatever color, from whatever country, from whatever race, we're all the same humans, we're all equal. And I do not like those kind of songs that try to separate music into a certain group. And on top of that, Nick Cannon, I will say this, or shall I say, Kick Nannon, because I don't think I deserve to say his name, that is the dumbest marketing plan I've ever heard for any music industry genre. Let's say one section of people is not allowed to listen to our music and not allowed to uh, enjoy it and not allowed to play it and not allowed to sing it. That's ridiculous. Ridiculous. Let's go. Guests in hip hop, huh? White people are guests in black music. What the fuck is black music? Music isn't a color. Music is a fucking sound. You call me guest in my... I mean, exactly. Powerful words right off the bat. I mean, come on. Music goes through your ears. How can your ears be racist? They don't see that stuff. And that stuff, in today's world, 99% of the world just doesn't exist anymore. Where it does exist, fake news. Where it does exist, fake Hollywood. Fake mainstream music that pushes the division that really truly isn't there. Let's go. Own house, bitch. I paid a mortgage, but I guess this ain't my home now. Who you think supports this sound? Huh? White people, yeah, that's right, people. You trying to scare me off because you scared that I might be you. Man, it's so fucking stupid. Hooping was made by a white man. I guess Michael Jordan is a guess that ain't right, man. Right? Can I? Wow. Wow. I mean, come on. He just flipped it right there. And, you know, it's not that case for basketball either. It's, you know, it's for everybody to enjoy. You know, art is art. I'm going to say this. I love this song already. I'm going to go ahead and give it two thumbs up. This guy's fire. This guy's underrated, man. Man, he should be played by, by more reaction channels. This guy needs to get definitely more spins. You guys need to go to his channel, subscribe, and check out his other stuff. St. Mises. Like Jesus with an M, St. Mises is the name of the YouTube channel. Go check us out. But here's an example of this. Okay, I'm an art teacher in an art class. I have a student, awesome, very talented artist, drawing me the most beautiful picture of an urban, sitting, urban city setting. The teacher looks at the kid and says, how dare you draw that? You're a farmer. You're from the country. Draw what you know. Don't draw this. On the flip side goes to the next kids drawing a beautiful picture of the of the country and says, well, why are you drawing that? You're not allowed to draw that. You're from the city. Draw your pictures from the city. That's how stupid it is when Nick Cannon and these groups of people say music's for one group of people. That's how stupid it is. Let's go. Nick, guess you think you fucking slick. And that was so slick, I'm going back so we can hear it again unbroken. Let's go. Bitch, I paid a mortgage, but I guess this ain't my home now. Who you think support this sound? Huh? White people, yeah, that's right, people. You trying to scare me off because you scared that I might be you. Man, it's so fucking stupid. Hooping was made by a white man. I guess Michael Jordan is a guess that ain't right, man, right? Can I? Nick, guess you think you fucking slick? Guess again, you fucking prick. Must not know who you fucking with. Music's colorless, it comes from with. And it's like a ghost. But I don't expect you to get that Cause the shit you spit's a joke Stick to comedy on your knees Suck Hollywood off some more Funny sh I agree, suck Hollywood off some more That's exactly where you need to stay 
Nick Cannon. Ridiculous. Let's go. It is you the whitest black dude that I fucking know. Wow. That is power. That's so power. We got to go back and hear that all together. Let's go. And uh, Nick, guess you think you fucking slick. Guess again, you fucking prick. Must not know who you fucking with. Music's colorless. It comes from with. And it's like a ghost. But I don't expect you to get that. Cause the shit you spit's a joke. Stick to comedy on your knees. Suck Hollywood or some more. Funny shit is you the whitest black dude that I fucking know. Why is he so mad? Keep on buying it and keep it quiet. Cracker. Fuck! This guy is fire. His lyrics are fire. His voice is mesmerizing. And he f he changes his flows. He can do whatever flow you want him to do. He can go fast, slow, medium. I mean, it's, it's, it's amazing. I'm a big fan of this guy. I'm definitely going to check out more of his music. He's going to the top of my playlist. You all need to go out there and check this guy out. Let's go. I was gonna say you just called me a crack. I don't have the rhythm to catch up now. I'm fucking behind the beat. And all the interweb subscribers and fans of, of this music and this song, let me know who he's making fun of here. I'm not for sure on this one. Let's go. Well, hook goes and now fuck us away. So comfortable on beats, I might go bugging naked to the lab. Put my life in writing. See, perfect example. Look how he changes the flow completely. I don't have the rhythm to catch up now. I'm fucking behind the beat. That's where the hook goes. And now fuck us away. So comfortable on beats, I might go bugging naked to the lab. Put my life in writing. Why you think it's called a fucking pad? Fuck you racist saying I'm a guessing rap cause I ain't black. I ain't bad for a white guy. Yeah, you could kiss my ass. I ain't bad for the greatest rapper on the fucking earth. What's the matter with color? My mom and dad were at my birth. You could eat a big fat bullet. What a point. Why does it matter what color you are when you're born? That's a decision that you can't choose to make. It's made for you. Yet in today's world, in today's fake news media, they use that and brainwash that into everybody to make everybody divide up over a decision that you could have never controlled or made in your life. It's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. The whole racing thing is just totally sad and ridiculous. It's getting ready to be 2020. I don't think there needs to be songs like that anymore. Music should be free for everyone. And wow, that was a powerful, powerful bar. I'm going back a little bit. I'm making this video too long. Let's go. Yeah, yeah, you could kiss my ass. I ain't bad for the greatest rapper on the fucking earth. What's the matter with color? My mom and dad were at my birth. You could eat a big fat bowl of dick if you think that my bars don't belong in records. My skin color don't match Lord Jamal. Becky, Becky, oh my gosh, why is he talking so harsh? Why does he feel like slavery is all his fucking fault? Probably cause it's fucking not. I just dropped a video. I love the subliminal message with all the black and white in the video. The video's fire. So the song's fire, the video's fire. It's thumbs up all around. Two thumbs up for the video, two thumbs up for the disc. This one was well needed and a well needed comeback to what Nick Cannon said. Let's go. Yo, with a new scene and I had the YouTube out of the nine. So, you know, like, clearly, I'm fucking, like, expert CEO, boss of KKK level racist when I have to YouTube out of a fucking you fucking moron. Man, rap is That's exactly what you get when you defend yourself in, in today's world. Uh, go check him out. Saint Mises. Go check his channel out. Subscribe. Uh, he, he's the artist. He, he deserves a spin. Go check him out. Check out our YouTube channel, The Real McCoy Reacts. Our IG channel is The Real McCoy Reacts. Subscribe feedback, uh, uh, the bell notification, thumbs this one up, give suggestions, we love comments like a family, we'll, we'll get back to you really, really quick, let's go. It's always been my crib, way before MTV Cribs, now you steaming cause my streaming money, paying for my crib, but hey, I didn't earn it right, and I don't deserve it right, to write lyrics with a hand that's white and crying about my perfect life, but what's the purpose, right, what's the point to bring this up, man, cause I ain't a guess it, it's the house that I grew up and I'm some people mad, but fuck all that, I got enough friends, tell them zip it before they get evicted, pay your fucking
get red. I'm about to get it in, huh, boy? I'm about to get it in. All you talking about is get fucked up and talking about my skin. I'm so fucking comfortable. No mumbling. You can understand every word. Powerful, powerful, powerful. I'm going to let this play out. I'm the real McCoy Reacts. I'm the real McCoy. This song's definitely the real McCoy and the real McCoy out. Oh, you fucking know this way I live. I guess you thought that I was just a guess around it. Powerful. Powerful comeback. I don't think Eminem needs to say anything, honestly. This guy.